I think that's really the key to finding your niche. Whatever your niche may be, it's investing in skills for yourself that you will be able to apply in a number of different situations. So for me, it's always been a very strong interest in language, in helping people to tell their stories in a way that is tailored to their specific audiences. So no matter what my job title is and no matter what it is I'm actually doing day to day in the tasks that I perform, I look at it as always a, an act of localization. Everything I do essentially is localization, which is, in my opinion, is taking one way of saying something and tailoring it so that it so that same message becomes more appealing to a different kind of audience. All right, so the obvious example is going from Japanese to English, literally changing the language. But as anyone who's worked in localization can tell you, there's a big difference between translation and localization. The popular term these days is transcreation. So that's sort of a third concept. But you know, whether we're going from one language to another language or even operating within the same language. So to give you a PR example, let's say that there's one extremely uh, tech heavy announcement that needs to be made because uh, some very impressive breakthrough has been made in this one specific area of technology but you need to be extremely well versed in that area of technology to understand why this breakthrough is not only important but interesting you need to find a way as a pr professional to spin that message to a way that makes sense to the average reader who has no specialty in that specific area or has no advanced knowledge in that area right so that's an act of localization and then even in employee engagement you meet an employee who is struggling to communicate with their manager struggling to thrive in a given situation it's an act of listening closely to what that person has to say and then using your accumulated knowledge and skills to be able to convey that same message to for example in this example to their manager in a way that sounds palatable to the manager sounds like something we can act on a problem that we can solve right so I would say that that's my niche. It's, it's finding a way to position myself between someone who's trying to tell a story and their audience and helping them to finesse that message to make it more meaningful for the person who needs to hear it.